who want to say, let us live within the ideals of Islam. Let's shun evil, let's shun whatever Islam says is against the religion, so that we make a better place to live in. We have always said that we should always focus on what brings us together, as opposed to what causes us problems, so that this world is a better place. I want to thank all those who have lived within that teaching of trying to put up bridges as opposed to causing mayhem in our country. We are here for a short time, so there is no reason why we should waste time in the unnecessary Kulabalu, but we should try and build friends and capacities. Hindu population and Christian population. And one thing that I'm massively proud about of my country is the tolerance. As Prince Kasim said, you know, one of the sad things about our world today is just how divided some people want to make it. But I firmly believe, and all of the teachings, the religious teachings that I hear, illustrate and underline how much more there is that unites us than ever divides us. And so it means a lot to me to be invited here tonight to share in that broad belief about the importance of faith in that message of tolerance, in that message of unity, and quite frankly in today's world, in that message of hope as well. So thank you so much for being so welcoming. It is genuinely an honor to be here.